Yo, yo, what's going on, world? This is Finney and St. Omer of the 1520s, and welcome to the main ingredient. So today's main ingredient, I got two joints I want to throw in. So first of all, I'm going to use a break beat that I already chopped up and put together a while back. And this was from Alan Toussaint, the song called Woman. And then the other main ingredient. Now, I have been one of those people that just never watched Squid Game, right? Then one of my you know closest friends I knew for like 40 joints, man. He came down to visit his family, moved down here, and you know, we was at the we was at his house at his mom's crib, and he was happy to watch it. So I'm sitting there like, I don't want to watch this foolishness. And then during one of the scenes, this song came on. And it's a song that we all know, but it was remade just for Squid Game. And it's this one is called Fly Me to the Moon by John. It was a Jew one. Now, let me make sure. Um, just looking up the name right now. Yeah, Ju One is the name of the artist that remade the song. So when I sat there and heard it, I was kind of glad I was forced to watch Squid Game. And, you know, I don't tend to follow what's, you know, super trending on Twitter and Instagram. Like, y'all got to watch this. Y'all got to watch this because nine times in the 10, it'd be trash. But, I mean, it was kind of eh. But the, the music is what struck me. And here we go. So we're going to make it right now. So let's go ahead and let's get these drums going. All right, let me brighten that up real fast. You already know what I'm going to do. You know what I mean? So let's get right to it. Let's get to the library. Hit the effects up and get these drums nice and bright. But matter of fact, you know what? I don't want them really bright. Let's just let's let's take them to the Kramer tape. To the Kramer drums. Okay, so let's do the drum kit joint. Take it to the group. All right. So just uh. Mess with some of these levels. All right, so yeah, as you can already tell, this is going to be a boom bappery. <laughs> this is going to be boom bappery, okay? <laughs> Whatever that means, no, boom bappery. <laughs> All right, let me, uh, hold on. I want to add the EQ to it. There we go. All right, so again... I'm going to chop this up. All right, so let's chop this up now. You get the idea, right? All right, so let's throw on the drums and try it again. That sounds nice. That sounds nice. I like that. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's brighten that up. Let me go back to my effects and get that going. And pardon if I'm sniffing, I just got over a, a, a super... 24, 48 hour cold. My son came home from school and gave me a cold. But I mean, I'm good. You know what I'm saying? But it's just the sniffles that's left over. So I'm going to sound like a 12 year old. You know what I mean? <laughs> like the character from Martin. You know what I'm saying? But um, but yeah, let me go ahead and get this going. Yeah. I, when I Again, I'm, I'm excited about this beat. I mean, it's just it's a simple joint. But, you know, when I heard the sample on the show, I was like, yeah, this is the one right here. This is definitely the one. And I can't wait. You know what I'm saying? To get it going. So let's go ahead and get that going.
don't mind me, I'm just still trying to get the sound right. Sorry, sorry, I forgot to <laughs> I forgot to make it four four ball measure. Alright, here we go. stuff around. All right, I like how that first half went, so let's just get ahead and get rid of that second half. Copy, paste, you already know. Let's get it done. Get it done right. Get it done quicker. All right. Let's see how that sounds. throw some bass in there let's go to you already know you're, I don't even know why <laughs> I have this conversation with y'all you know we go to dub bass you know what I'm simple chords simple 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 before I do that let me just go ahead and EQ that filter it out really because, you know, I like to have my, take that resonance down. All right, so I think I figured out the bass. Let me just get one more check. right there. We just adjust it real fast, hold on. All 
All right. What else can I add to this? Hmm. Let's let's shop around. Where am I go? Where am I go? tambourines in there Gonna do this whole thing like that. <laughs> okay, cool. I had to copy that, paste that. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna be over here wasting my time being off beat, having y'all laughing at me every week. I'm not doing that. Am I, am I here to amuse you? Oh man, hold on, I messed up. I'm not here to amuse you, son. Well, let me just adjust that. There we go. Now go ahead and copy, paste it everywhere else. And then turn it down. That's all I'm going to do. I'm just going to turn it down real nice. And then, bang. Move on to the next. there right little lower don't need it to overpower nothing there you go all right what else can we add what else can we add in that tune folder, but I don't, really, I don't think I need anything from there right now. All right, so maybe I'm done with the percussions. I like the bongo. Pan that to the left. Yeah, I think that's it. 
go ahead and just stretch this joint out. You know what I mean? Go ahead and give it a go. Because I think I'm done. I think I'm done. This is going to be one of those joints that's going to need a scratch up. You know what I'm saying? It gives me that, uh... Bring it on if you think you can hang. You know what I'm saying? Like... That, that, that jigger joint. Bring it on. That's <laughs> the name of the record. It, it gives me that type of feel. You know what I'm saying? Because of the... Because of the strings. But yeah, I like this. So yeah, with that being said... I appreciate everybody for tuning in every week. Every Monday at 9 p.m. You already know what time it is, man. Buymeacoffee.com slash golden era music. And please subscribe to youtube.com slash golden era music as well. Make sure you're following me on Instagram and Twitter at Finney and St. Omer. And I got some good news for those that are, you know, fans of the Sean Don brand. If you remember my first album on Golden Era Music, it was called The Jammington. I just started a campaign and it's going to be a campaign to press up vinyl because the 10 year anniversary is coming up on March 6, 2022. March 6, 2022, 10 years. So to celebrate 10 years, this will be the first time. First of all, I never had vinyl before. So for The Jammington to have vinyl for the very first time, very first vinyl on Golden Era Music and very first vinyl for me is monumental. So, you'll see the link right on the bottom. This is where you can go and make a purchase. The, the vinyl is $35. It will ship to you in April because it's going to take about, you know, 15, well, they said actually 16 to 20 weeks. So, it'll be right after the 10 year anniversary, but you already know. So, vinyl takes forever. But that's it. Check it out, man. You know, you click the link and, you know, buy some vinyl. Especially it's my first vinyl. Hook me up, you know what I mean? And I just want to shout out my man, uh, No Facade Brand. You know, their, their uh, Instagram is on the bottom of the screen. This is Respect My Aura. You know what I'm saying? I love this hoodie. He gave me this hoodie a while back. It still holds up like it's just brand new. That's the quality he got. So shout to No Facade's Brand. And that's my time, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed this beat. Once again, my name is Phineas St. Omer. This is the main ingredient. And make sure you go to beatstars.com slash the 1520s. This beat will be available right now. Of course, it is all exclusive. No leases. It's yours. You buy it, it's yours. Like I tell you every week. So tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a thousand friends. Go buy beats from me at beatstars.com slash the 1520s. I will see y'all next week. It's been a pleasure rocking out with y'all, man. It's, I love doing this show, but that's my time. I'm going to go lay down so I can get rid of this cold. Peace.